So there's there's three. I'm going to get you to do to do this. Um, but there's three fundamentals in the motion. There's an alignment. Okay, and the alignment exists between the two ends. Okay, that's that's the alignment we're talking about. It's it's not one that the camera might see in relation to the target or the target line or anything else, right? It's purely an alignment between the apex, the club head, and the base, the two feet. Okay, then there's a fundamental sequence. And the fundamental sequence is from base to apex and back again. When I said earlier that it starts out folded over, it unfolds once and refolds once, so does the sequence also travel from base to apex once and from apex back to base. That's it. There is no five step sequence, okay? And then the last thing is that it all goes in one direction. Okay, so the way that I, I mean that is, you see this circle here? Okay, if I was to put my finger like a pencil on a piece of paper and draw a circle, I'd go in one direction yep. to complete that circle. So when we start out folded and we unfold, we don't refold, we don't stop and refold in the manner we've gone uh, unfolded. In other words, we don't just reverse course, we keep going. So we unfold and refold all in the one direction. Fair enough? So if you watch from here, if I unfold and refold, I didn't have to necessarily change direction if I think about it in the, in the terms that I said before. Now, obviously, if I draw a circle on a piece of paper, you'll say, well, you're going from the camera's view, you're going left, you're going left, down, right, up, and left again, yeah, to make your circle. Yep. It's like that's many different directions, but not really. No, not really. No. Not from the person doing it. And, and I think that's probably <coughs> one of the difficulties with, with, with most golfers is they see it in two entirely different directions. Yes. You know, it's a, but, but, but when you get this, this roundness in the swing and the circular sort of you know, personality of the swing and the character of the swing, as you're demonstrating there, mm. that's, if you can just get that in your head, that it is one direction, yes. all the time one direction, one direction, one direction, and not... We're not going this way and then this way. Right. We're just going one direction. Well, I think this is, if going back to previous iterations of me trying to explain this, where that was a difficult uh, thing for people to, to reconcile is that they weren't seeing it at the time as being this... Well, I didn't see that. Right. No, that's right. No, and, no. and I was with you from, from the foundation yeah. of the swing, but it was always one direction. That yes, you, that's you right. the terminology. Yes. But the thing is, is that when you when you view it as an unfolding and refolding, rather than a swing to the right and a swing to the left, which is how most people yeah. view the swing. Now, I can unfold and refold all in one motion like that, right? If that's what I'm doing, rather than swinging side to side, which is what most people view it as. Yeah, well, they try to, yeah.